Hi, my name is John Pisani. I'm an engineer with Electro Harmonics, and today we're going to show you our new crying bass pedal. It's our latest pedal in the Next Step line, which also includes the crying tone wah, the talking pedal, the uh, pan pedal, volume, and expression pedals. We are really proud of our Next Step line. We think it's revolutionary because as you rock the pedal with your foot, there are no moving parts. Um, nothing to break down, nothing wears out, um, and you can move it freely. It looks really great. It's got sleek new styling. We think it looks really cool actually. It's very rugged and uh, it's got great feel with your feet. Uh, feels instantaneous, in fact. We have been listening to feedback from our customers and they have been asking for a way to uh, attach their next step pedal to their pedal board. So we came up with our new Electro Harmonics pedal board cradle. So we can insert the next step pedal into the cradle and you, as you can see it moves around freely and uh, it attaches to your pedal board with Velcro that we provide and we also have a Velcro strap that you can tie down the next step pedal with while you're traveling. So it's gig friendly and ready to go and inexpensive. So now we're gonna move over to John Skibbick. He's going to play and talk about the crying bass. So I hope you enjoy it. Hi, I'm John from Electro Harmonics and this is the new EHX crying bass pedal. It's the latest in the Next Step series, and this one's designed for bass players with a built-in fuzz and a low-pass filter to retain the bottom end. So go check it out, and let's, let's give it a listen. Let's listen to the bass uh, with no effect. Here's the crying bass with the fuzz and the low pass filter, both set to zero. To turn the pedal on, you simply rock it forward and the pedal's engaged. Let's listen to the same riff with the fuzz set to five and the low pass filter set to six. <laughs> <laughs> 